When it comes to sourcing new financing, company size matters for available alternative sources. If your annual revenue is under $2 million, it's friends and family for equity and small lenders for debt. For those with annual revenues above $3 million, the options become more available. There are smaller lenders, both bank and non-bank lenders, that may like your story and want to talk to you. The cost of this financing will be higher for that type of lender. So which type of financing will work best for you? That depends on what you'll use the money for and how long you'll need it. Take a look at this chart for a simple way to think about it. A bank term loan will likely give you the most flexibility, depending on loan covenants. An equity investor will need the eventual exit and suitable return on their investment. So likely this will be the most complex arrangement. A what-if model may be the best tool for determining which financing model works best for your company. By looking at different scenarios of what the cash will do to support your business growth, you can determine how much cash you will need, what you can afford for a payback period, and whether the growth plan will be profitable after the increased financial cost, and how much risk you'll be willing to take. Once you have looked at your possible scenarios, then you are ready to look for funding sources. For most middle market businesses, the new tax regulations will not restrict the type of financing that works best for you. You will likely be below the thresholds that limit tax deductions, so focus on what you feel are your best sources. If you have a current banking relationship, start there. Your current banker will have ideas on what they can do or be able to refer you to other sources. If this process seems too complex, don't put it off. Just give us a call and we can help you figure out your needs. We do this analysis all the time and we may be able to help you at no cost.